Now that we power back, welcome back to some more Stormworks. I'm Stormwinter Gaming, and today I would like to formally invite you to leave 2020 behind as we jump into the new year in 2021. And it is a pretty exciting year for not only my channel as we keep growing into the future, but Stormworks as well. If you guys haven't figured out by now, it is sort of my main game here that I keep coming back to for holidays, special videos, all this and that. Although I am trying to branch out a little bit, I do have a quick page on what the developers have for updates for 2021 here with some big things like that weapons update. Definitely, I'm looking forward to two things just like that but enough of that let's jump into what i've got today in stormworks as i turn off my controller little icon there i need to throw the lights on this and i do have to give some credit out for this creation here because i didn't actually create this firework type of show here it was actually a good friend zendra from my discord channel they play a bunch of stormworks and they actually created a huge stage, but this is actually just one kind of motor. I'm going to give you a little taste before we go on to the full show here. So without further ado, let's hit that button if I can actually turn it on. And I do have Bloom on, but as you can see, there's this cool kind of lighting effect with the smoke from the big engine because it's pouring on and off and on and off the light kind of fades on and then off and i think if we get a different angle yeah it's stronger on the angle you're looking at so if i get just about in the middle here it looks the best it possibly can and i don't know if this will end but this is kind of the basis that zendra built their new year stage on so i'm a little bit unsure but enough of that let's get the actual main event out here here we are with the main event, and as you can tell, it is a big creation right here. But I'm not going to reveal just all of it yet. We actually have to get it out of the garage with this little driver's seat so we can activate it outside. Let me just make sure I can actually tell. Okay, we're moving. I see the edges of the garage flying away from us. We don't need to go that far. We don't have much battery life on here, but hit those brakes. All right, we're off. And now in the moonlight here, we can see the full New Year's stage here. And it looks pretty awesome with six of those modules, those large engine modules on here. And a couple other little tricks and features with lights as well. So without further ado, let me find this button and turn it on. Here we go. And we've got the lights bumping from the sides all the way to the middle. And I love the little dance of the different colors of the rainbow going around here but and we're gonna have a little bit building up right after that with the engines turning on next and these are actually the same exact engines I was showing off earlier with those cool lighting effects going up and away from the smoke I think this far out actually you might not get as much of a image on it yeah see now you can see the kind of blurred lines that make it really cool it looks kind of like a rock concert or something from right here I'm going to back away from it yet again because we've got the fireworks going off. I was just a little bit late for that. But then the New Year's star at the end of it with a few more fireworks. Oh, I'm in the ground. Whoops. And they all come raining back down. Ooh, it is very bright here. Yeah, for this to actually give you the full effect, I had to have Bloom on. Which, as you can tell, it is quite very bright here, so you can't see much of anything. It's just, like, extremely white there, but yeah. So if you guys do want to pick up this amazing stage here, I will leave the link to the workshop creation in that description down below. Yet again, built by Zendra. As well, I'd like to quickly promote one of my friends here on YouTube, Fallon Plays. Me and him have been doing some great videos here on YouTube for the past year. And you should probably go check him out. He does some Stormworks as well as some amazing other games. So I'd like to give him a quick shout out here before the end of the year. Well, I guess it is the new year already. Anyway, that is where I will be ending this episode, so of course if you guys did like this, please leave a like and consider subscribing to the channel to stay up with Stormworks and more of my content, but I've never been great to goodbye, so people need me, and I need to go.